Well, now Liz Truss is firmly ensconced in Number 10 Downing Street and getting on with the job of being Prime Minister. She, of course, has inherited a firestorm of trouble from uh, what's going on in Dover, the general cost of living, fuel, Ukraine, and, of course, our energy bills, gas and electricity. Getting out of control, isn't it? Something has to be done and something has to be done now. Where well, there are rumours afoot that she is expected to announce something and I'll tell you what that is now. How do everybody? Welcome back to the channel for a Wednesday. Hope you're doing all right. I'm not too bad at all. Not too bad. Let me know how you're doing in the comments below. It'd be good to hear from you. Well, we've all got this problem, haven't we, with the gas and electricity. It's uh, going out of control. Uh, you know, this so-called price cap. It's not a price cap at all. It's just an excuse to hire the prices up and up and up and up and up. And we need it stopping. Uh, you know, really, the bills have got to come back down again. But I can't see that happening anytime soon. Can you uh, let me know what you think about that? But I, I think it's not good. I mean, what's fully expected to happen is a freeze to be placed on... Uh, you know, the gas and electricity bills. So at least there's some kind of certainty. We know what we've got to find every month. Uh, you know, it's just one of the options uh, on the table. And they reckon that this one alone is going to cost 100 billion quid. Now, I'd love to know where that's going to come from, but they, they are talking about, uh, you know, allowing the gas and electricity companies to borrow money uh, to subsidise the bills. So where where is that coming from? It just seems like a whole cycle of nonsense to me. But, you know, that's that's what's on the table. And apparently any freeze in our bills will only be for about two years. So it will not be a permanent thing. And then I can see it going up and up and up again. I mean, there's difficult times ahead for everybody. Uh, winter's coming. It's the old and the vulnerable I feel particularly sorry for. How are we going to help them? What are we going to what are we going to achieve? You know, I, I think everybody, if you know somebody that's vulnerable or in that position, keep an eye on them. Make sure they're OK. Uh, this is where communities come in, isn't it? We've got to make sure we're all right together. Let me know what you think about all this in the comments below, whether a freeze is coming. You've got any other suggestions like Andy the Gabby Gabby for PM? I've seen that a few times. And let's stick together. Toodaloo.